What's up everybody, Unrested back again and spending another beautiful day out here in the great weather of fall here in Japan. And I wanted to go ahead and just take this JFAC just to address a couple things that have been coming up recently with kind of my newly spawned videos, or I should say Tikio Sam and I's newly spawned videos. And that is the fact that we now do our show every Wednesday. That's every Wednesday for those of you who've been asking. Some people, uh, I, I do, I do little reminders, but I guess there's never really been a point where I've said it's going to be every Wednesday. But yes, that is going to be a consistent show, and it is going to be every Wednesday now, and it will always be starting um, at 9:30 till 10:30. That's Tokyo time, and I'm sorry, I can't figure offhand what all the different time codes are for that but pretty much tune in if you can and please know if you do miss it we will always keep it recorded YouTube actually automatically records it and then we will consistently upload it to either Sam's site or my site so if you ever miss one of those don't fret don't worry if it's coming on while you're asleep you'll be fine we'll always put it up there and you will always have a chance to watch it again I also want to address some of the people who are shouting about how they can't believe I'm doing videos with Sam, his personality is so different from me, his humor and disposition is so abrasive, why would you ever want to make a video with him? Well, um, the thing is guys, if I just did the show with someone who had my exact same personality, there wouldn't be any kind of yin and yang to the show, there wouldn't be any kind of black and white, it would be all gray area. So the fact that his personality is so different from mine is what makes the show uh, kind of the selling point for the show. Um, some people might complain, oh, I don't really like it. I don't think he's a good match for you. You guys uh, shouldn't really team up to make a show. But going to have to disagree with you there. Our first show alone had over 20,000 views. Now, also another thing recently, people have been complaining that they couldn't see the show when it came on. And at first, Sam and I thought that that was actually something we were doing wrong. But unfortunately, what it seems is um, YouTube and Google have a lot to work out. There seems to be quite a bit of problems with that interface still. And it's not very consistent. Either, number one, there's a massive delay of when we show up. Like, we'll start the video and it'll finally come on, like, almost 30 or 20 minutes later. It's absolutely ridiculous. Or, like, last time, for some reason, and I was quite sure that this was actually Google's problem, our cameras wouldn't let us see ourselves. And at first I totally, I thought there was something completely wrong with my camera. Give me a break man called me up and asked me what was going on with that, that he couldn't see his camera either. So finally we both realized, oh, it's not our cameras, it's actually Google. Uh, another thing that's going to be coming up soon, and I don't have an exact date with this, I think it's either going to be one week or two weeks from now, is I'm actually going to be on the 2.5 Oyachi show. I'm really excited about that. That's a show I've wanted to be on for quite a long time, and Give Me a Break Man called me the other week and just let me know that they want to have me on there. So at some point I am going to be on there. I will give you ample warning as I am very excited to be on that show. Finally, last but not least, those of you who do decide that you don't enjoy watching Sam on my channel or a fan of mine but not a fan of Sam's, YouTube's got this great feature. It's called Don't Watch My Channel, okay? You don't have to like it. You don't have to watch uh, that show. You don't have to watch 2.5 Maji Yabai Yatsura. Nobody's forcing you to watch that. In fact, since I label every single video that comes up, you know for a fact when it is one of those videos. So. I understand. It's okay. It's not everybody's cup of tea. I completely understand that. But then again, if it isn't, please realize there's no point in you coming there and complaining about Sam. Number one, YouTube is a place to come for entertainment. Number two, it's a place people come to have fun and relax. It's not a podium for people to bring negativity. Okay, No one comes there to be stressed out or uh, have ample negativity. So if you want to come there and do a rant about how much you hate him. Don't be surprised if you're blocked and deleted. I'm not really up for that on my channel. My channel is meant as a source of entertainment. It's listed as a source of entertainment and it's only meant to be there for fun, relaxing entertainment. Uh, if you want to come there and rant and rave about how much you hate TKO Sam, uh, you will, of course won't be addressed in any way. You will just be blocked and deleted, which is natural with me when it comes to anything I consider non-constructive criticism. 
Um, on top of that, do know that you don't actually know Sam. You don't actually know him or me, really. I mean, you see our videos, right? We put ourselves out there for you. But these are our on-air personalities. You might actually realize that in real life, we're not actually like that. We're a little bit different. From what you see on the video, we're actually a little bit different in real life. And another thing you should realize is that in real life, Sam is a really good guy, okay? He is the type of friend who has always been there for me, always backed me up, been a genuine help at any question that I've had here in Japan. Of course, he's been here the same amount of time as me, but you both learn different things in your different areas. He's in Tokyo and I'm in Osaka. So we've both learned different things and helped each other out along the way. And the fact is, is that if I've ever had a question or had something concerning, one time it was a law question actually, and I called him up and he was quick to help me and answer me. He's also helped me with computer problems and stuff before. And that's just because it's the benefit of friendship. And that's another aspect you guys just never see because you only see our on-air personalities. So I... I, I recommend that you excuse yourself from judging people from what you see on videos because, for example, the Nostalgia Critic, obviously on air he's a very abrasive, uh, hardcore guy, but do you think he's really like that in real life? No, it's, com it's a character, okay? Same with us. Everybody becomes a bit of a character when they're on video, and it's something you need to realize and something that you need to take into association when you are commenting on these videos if you want to be negative in your criticism that's non-constructive. Until next time, I'm Unrested. This is JFAC. Have a good one.